In this section, we're going to walk through creating the headers and paragraphs for your page. So a header is, and paragraphs are very much like when you're typing up a paper in any class. Uh, you have six different headers that you can use, and obviously header one is going to be for the most important information. And after that, you just work your, your way down to header two, three, four, and five. So no matter what your paper is about, for instance, header one is your large category, your large title, a dream vacation to Paris. And then you'll start with your individual topics, your, your main sub points. Uh, I'm just going to talk about transportation, dining, sightseeing, but maybe under the dining section of your paper, your page, you want to talk about different restaurants you would go to. Or if you're going around sightseeing, then your first destination, like the Arc de Triomphe would be uh, your H3, and the Eiffel Tower would, would be another H3. So let's see how that looks on our page. So I'm going to open up Code Writer. And in the body, I'm going to open bracket H1 and close it. And again, what I love about Code Writer is it'll automatically put the closing tag for you. And you can just go ahead and put your paragraph, your placeholders for your paragraph. Uh, H2. I'm going to put a, a map of where I want to go visit. Talk about maybe the language or the dialect I speak there. And you can copy and paste. You don't have to um, type this out every time. In fact, that's what I'm going to do. Highlight it. Control C. Control V. And I'm going to change language to food. And I'm going to change this to music. Music to holidays. In that particular country. Alright, and then I'm going to paste my paragraphs in between those. So now you've set it up where you can easily go and insert your information. All right, so I'm going to save this now. Save as, put it in my folder. It's already called Spanish blog, save. And now let me open that up and see what it looks like. All right, there we go.